I'm glad just to see that we had this type of turnout. I think these guys are getting a lot out of this. We're trying to teach them fundamentals and mechanics, and, and a little bit we'll go inside and, and do some chalk talk and you know, just teach them X's and O's. So I, I think it's a great opportunity for these guys to come down here and actually learn about the position, and, and hopefully they, they get something out of it. You know, for a lot of these kids, they, they still know who I am. And, you know, it's kind of makes me realize how old I'm getting when some of these guys say, you know, you played in Kentucky or, you know, you played in the NFL. And, but, you know, it, it's, it's, it's a good feeling, though, to, to come out here and give these kids something back and, and, and allow them to, you know, learn something with mechanics, fundamentals, about playing the position and, and, and get to do something besides being at home and watching TV or something. You know, they're actually out doing something positive. The reason I hired Andre in the first place is what I've seen out of him uh, at camps at the University of Kentucky. And when I watched him work with uh, young kids, middle school kids, high school players, um, that is what stood out to me. So not only is he a great asset from a name standpoint, but on the playing field for us, he's a tremendous teacher. I truly enjoy being around uh, the coaching staff, especially Rob Tenure. I think that uh, his direction for this program is, has been tremendous, and I think he's really going to do a fabulous job here. And I'm excited to see what we do this upcoming season. It, it's exciting to have him on staff. Uh, and uh, he's going to do great things for us. He's going to help us in recruiting. But for someone that played in the SEC and has NFL experience, uh, and, and that was part of the process of getting Andre here. Uh, and he has bought into our vision and our commitment here. And he knows this is a great starting point. This is quality football, Division I football, an automatic bid to the FCS playoffs now. And, uh, uh, and so I think he's excited about his, his time here and his commitment to Moorhead State.